How's it going? So I think I kind of thought about it a little bit more. I think I know what he's talking about. He's saying there isn't such thing as winners and losers queue. So what he's saying is the system does not mark you for losers queue and then put you into a team that's going to lose. That's what he's saying. So there's no such thing as this system. What he's saying, however, there is a system that will over time loosen up the balancing team rules, which ideally wants to be 1000. And then it will obviously um, scoop players from wider range of uh, MMR. To which I'm going to say is what he's saying is true, but it is still a loser's cube because I'll tell you why. And you are, you you will be marked for loser. I'll tell you how it works. Okay, I'll tell you how it works. Right? If the if the system cannot match, cannot create a balanced match, it's going to create an unbalanced match where one side is going to be stronger than the other. But since you have won most of the games, past three games, you are highly likely to be on the losing team because you are considered by the system as a strong player. If that makes sense. So... To some extent, although you probably not physically are marked for loser's queue, you still end up in the loser's queue because of your performance. And like I said before, the easiest way for the system to deal with a high-performing player, a superstar, is to put four shooters on his team and then put five good players on the enemy team. This is the easiest way and the fastest way to create a match because we have to remember that. Riot priority is to find a fast match, not a quality match. Because trying to find a, per a person who has, let's say, like in my case, like 25 KDA with 100% win rate is close to impossible. So what it does is it put four extremely bad players on your side and um, five good to excellent players on the enemy team. And then that's why you get this fiesta where you are trying to, like, you have to get, like, 50 kills to win the game. Literally speaking right so you are in fact marked for the loser's queue because of your performance if that makes sense because again we're talking about a system that will create a match that is not balanced and you are likely to be on the losing side so in indirect way there is winners and losers queue because that's the way the system works Okay, so just wanted to clarify this. Take care, bye-bye.